Hey Bob, wanted to do one last video for you because I had not covered the backyard. Uh, got interrupted when uh, company arrived and um, wanted to kind of just walk through the backyard a little bit and finish a complete walkthrough of the property. So this one backs up to um, Rambling Stream, the road that we came off of when we we're on Rodine Road. I'm trying to think of the name, but that's what it backs up to. It's not a main main road like 301, but it's it's definitely a, a, a pass through road. Now remember, this house is vacant, so all the sounds are more magnified and echoed than when you have furniture. It's not. It's not bad, honestly. I mean, I can I can hear it. Um, Just wait for some more cars to come by. It's actually pretty, pretty quiet. So, anyway, let's go outside. Just want to kind of get a moment to hear what it sounds like inside the house. Let's see what it's like outside. Jason had mentioned you might want to do a patio. Um, completely possible. You have the space. You can see what the neighbors have run their fence line to, so you can certainly go that far. Um, it does slope upwards, but you could have the land changed um, and kind of make it more of a flat uh, backyard and then have a wall, like some type of retention wall instead, I think that'd be completely fine. You see, most people have a fence. As a matter of fact, everybody has a fence. You'd almost think it was the HOA who had done it, but I'm assuming not if this one does not have a fence. This is a seven-year-old house, so the roof is just fine, and there's nothing hanging over the roof. You can see this one person put a really nice enclosure. You can see it's uh, kind of a screened enclosure. So it's com completely possible. And then this is the road that we hear. And we'll go back inside one more time just to hear how it is. And I already showed you the sides. So you can fence that in. And this side as well. No gutters. So I'd recommend gutters. These windows do have a slight tint to them. Just gonna Stand here for another minute or two just to kind of hear how the noise sounds. But it's like I said, this is a block house, so it's this, the noise is coming through the windows, and with really um, high quality windows, that's. It, completely knock out the noise. But like I said, also furnishing the house will uh, help as well. But everyone has their own uh, comfort level. Some people consider it a white noise and they even start to not even notice it. And then others are sensitive to it. 
Um, you know, one good thing is the way the land slopes, you have no, well, if you put a fence up, I guess you do have a visual of it right now, but if you put a fence up, you won't even see it. So, so that would be the only thing that I would say that would be, like if you go to resell it, that you might have um, negative feedback on. The house itself is, is, is updated. Appliances are new, kitchen looks great. Open floor plan, has really tall ceilings. Tile floor throughout. I'm gonna lock up here. Does have the uh, exterior light on the corner of the property. All right, so I'll go ahead and end this video. Bye.